in time. Something interesting is taking shape. Come on. Oh, come on, Orbit. Let us see. Yeah, what are you making? Ta-da! It's for the Intergalactic Art Show. What do you think? Wow! A cat! Cool. I really like it. Me too. I wish I had one just like it. Really? Well, I can make you one. For real? Just like it? Sure. But how are you going to do that, Orbit? You're all out of parts. Oh, I don't know. Maybe we could find a hardware store. They'd have parts. Or better yet, why don't we go someplace where we can make a copy of Orbit Sculpture? Yes! Yeah! Great idea! And that sounds like we have a mission. And you know what that means. <laughs> it's time for us to pick a planet. Control? Hi, everyone. How can I help you today? We want to find a place where we can copy Orbit Sculpture. All right. Let's see where you can go. Round and round the planets go. Which one stops? Nobody knows. The snowy planet? But every snowflake is unique. We won't find copies of anything there. The puzzle planet? Jigsaw pieces are all different. No copies there either. <laughs> the copycat planet. A place with all kinds of copies. Perfect. The copycat planet. Good choice. Get ready for countdown. Hurry, everyone. Get to your stations and buckle your seatbelts. Stop the copycat planet. Why did I have to make this so heavy? Wow, look at all the copies. On the copycat planet, everything seems to have a copy, except this box. What do you think it is? It must be the machine that makes the copies. How do you think it works? Well, this looks like the on button. machine, all right? It made an exact copy of Orbit. But which one's the real Orbit? I am. Excuse me? You're the copy. I'm the real deal. Oh, you're real, all right. Real confused. I'm the real deal. No, you're a copycat. Stop pretending to be me in front of Rob, Emma, and TK. I'm not a copycat. I'm Orbit. And who are Rob, Emma, and TK? Aha! Uh -huh. He's the copy. Because he doesn't know who we are. Ha <laughs> ha! Told you! I'm the real deal! Guys, we came here to copy Orbit's sculpture, not Orbit. Exactly! We need to fix this! Fix this? What do you mean? Being Orbit is awesome! No way! I'm a one-of-a-kind robot. There can't be two orbits. Nuh-uh. I'm a one-of-a-kind robot. Don't be jealous. I know you are, but what am I? I know you are, but what am I? Ugh. 
bet you can't do everything I do. Wow, he's good. Was always makes me feel better. What am I going to do now? I'm supposed to be an exact copy. I'm sure if we work together, we can figure out how to make you orange again. You do that for me? <laughs> I bet. Sure would. Yes, if I have to have a copy, I'd rather you be a happy copy than a sad one. So let's find a way to change you back. <laughs> Copy machine! It'll be great to be an exact copy again, just like these flowers. Huh? Ah! They smell nice. Hey, how come you're not sneezing? What's sneezing? Huh? Ah! Ah! Ha -cha! <laughs> that is. Flowers always make me sneeze. Really? Weird. They don't do that to me. Ah! Sneeze! <laughs> don't worry, they're gone. Huh? How come you weren't startled? I don't know, they're just bees. Nothing to be afraid of. Really? They freak me out. Hmm, you know... I'm starting to think maybe you and I aren't exactly alike. Hey, Orbits! Come quick! We figured out the copy machine! <laughs> there! We're all set! Right, TK? Looking good, Rob! All systems set to... Orange! Hop on in! I think... I think I changed my mind. Huh? What's the matter, Orbit 2? Well... I know I'm supposed to be orange because I'm a copy, but I think I like being blue. I like being different. Is that okay? Is that okay? Is that okay? Yes! Of course that's okay! <laughs> Do you know what this means? It means I'll be a one-of-a-kind robot! Yes! And I'll be a one-of-a-kind orbit again! Woohoo! What changed your mind? I realized it wasn't so bad being different. In fact, it makes me feel kind of special. You are special. And you know, you'd be even more special if you had a unique name. Yeah. How about Tibro? Tibro? That's Orbit. Spelled backwards. <laughs> oh, that's great. Hey, do you want to come back with us, Tibro? There's room on our rocket. Thanks. But I'm going to stay with the copy machine. Since we're both unique to this planet, we should stick together. Okay, we'll come back and visit you sometime. Goodbye, Bye, See you soon! Oh, wait! Emma, I still need to make you a copy of my cat sculpture. It is a good sculpture, Orbit. But why don't you make me something different instead? You know, something unique. Yeah, like Tibro and me. Hmm, I've got some clay on the rocket. Maybe I'll make a dog sculpture. Great idea, Orbit. And I think this is one unique <laughs> mission accomplished. Yeah! Mission control? Hi, Rob, you're back. So, 
What did you learn on your mission? <laughs> we went to the copycat planet so Orbit could make a copy of a sculpture for Emma. But instead of making a copy of the sculpture, we accidentally copied Orbit. Orbit likes being a one-of-a-kind robot, so when his copy turned blue, Orbit was really happy. But then his copy became really sad, until he realized it's okay to be different. Being different and unique means being special. Well done! I think it's time to go home. Better buckle up! Five, four, three, two, one! arts teach focus, some teach stealth, and others teach hand-eye coordination. I could show you. Oh, right! Then we'll all have ninja fast hands, fast enough to catch that crazy fly. <laughs> but <gasps> is there enough room on the rocket for all of us to train? No, we'll need a special place. And that sounds like we have a mission. And you know what that means. <laughs> it's time for us to pick a planet. Pick a planet! 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 Mission Control? Hi, everyone. How can I help you today? We want to go someplace where I can teach everyone martial arts. Oh, how exciting! Let's see where you can go. Round and round the planets go. Which one stops? Nobody knows. The vegetable planet. A good place to chop veggies, but not to karate chop. Kia! Hmm, Halloween planet. Great for dressing up like a ninja, but not for learning martial arts. Dojo Planet! Dojos are where martial artists train. Yes, the Dojo Planet. Excellent choice. Get ready for countdown. Hurry, everyone. Get to your stations and buckle your seatbelts.
get really good at martial arts, the first thing we need to learn is meditation. Let me show you. Close your eyes, breathe slowly, and focus only on your pose. How are we going to learn martial arts if we're sleeping? The more we practice imagining each pose, the easier it is to do them when we finally try. Meditation teaches you focus. Now you try. Imagine the pose you want to take, then slowly take it. Almost got it. Phew. I'm meditating. Can I open my eyes yet? Orbit, shh. Focus on your pose. Oops. Sorry. Hey, maybe I can do this. Oh no. Sorry, I'll never learn this martial arts stuff or catch that pesky fly. You will, Orbit. You just need to believe you will. Ninja? <laughs> it's called ninjutsu. Ninjutsu training helps with stealth. Stealth? If you want to be a ninja or a good flycatcher, you need to be fast and move without being seen. That's what stealth means. We'll practice with this. What does ninjutsu have to do with squeaky wagons? I'm going to make it disappear. I'll believe this when I don't see it. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Hey, I don't see it. Ah! How'd you do that? Always be aware of what's around you and move when no one's looking. Oh, I bet I can do that. Uh -um. Look, a crouching tiger. Are you okay? I'm fine. I'm just too clumsy to be a ninja. Nobody gets it right on the first try, Orbit. You have to stay positive and keep at it. Come on! Draw the arrow, focus, and release. Whoa! Kyudo training is my favorite. Kyudo is the Japanese word for target archery. To master Kyudo, you need to have good hand-eye coordination and focus. Ah, those are all the skills I don't have. Focus only on the target and believe you can hit it, Orbit. Place your feet, ready the bow, draw the arrow. Like this? Ah, ah. Other way, Orbit! Wrong way, Orbit. Orbit! Focus on the target, not us. Sorry. Feet, body, ready the bow, draw the arrow. I believe, I believe. Draw it all the way, release. <laughs> Jumping space bugs, I hit it. See, Orbit, I knew you could do it. Cool, can I try again?
to catch him that time, and I did. Learning martial arts is awesome. Ha <laughs> ha, I knew you could do it. And that makes this one big mission accomplished. Mission Control? Hi, Rob, you're back. So, what did you learn on your mission? to the dojo planet so I could teach everyone martial arts. The first step was learning focus, so we practiced meditation. But Orbit had a difficult time with that pesky space fly buzzing about. Next, we learned ninjutsu to help us with stealth. But it's hard to be stealthy when you're making a lot of noise. Then we tried Kyudo to help improve our hand-eye coordination. And sure enough, once Orbit focused, he hit the target. When you're trying to learn new things, always stay positive and never give up. Orbit kept at it, and he finally got pretty good. He just needed to believe in himself. Well done. I think it's time to go home. Better buckle up. Five, four, three, two, one. To what? A picnic? I love yummy picnics. Oops. I'm hungry. Even better! It's an invitation for the Great Galactic Cook-Off. Only, it's tomorrow? That doesn't give you much time to come up with a dish. I need to find my recipe book. Quick! <gasps> oh, my chef's hat. Wow. There are so many awesome recipes in here. Too many. How am I going to choose? Don't worry. We'll help you. We can even help with the cooking. And we can help with the tasting. You guys are the best. OK, first, we need some fresh ingredients to inspire me to come up with an amazing dish. We can stop at the Galaxy Grocery. Yeah! But that's all the way on the other side of the galaxy. Hmm. The sooner we find food, the sooner we can cook <gasps> and eat. <laughs> yeah! And that sounds like we have a mission. <laughs> and you know what that means. <laughs> <laughs> it's time for us to pick a planet. Everyone, how can I help you today? We want to find some fresh ingredients to cook up the galaxy's greatest meal. What a delicious mission! Okay, let's see where you can go. I love the soccer planet, but I'm way too hungry to play right now. Stinky Fun Planet? Stinky toe jam. Now that's a yummy looking planet. The food planet. Delicious choice. Now get ready for countdown. Hurry, everyone. Get to your stations and buckle your seatbelts.
planet. If it's what I think it is, we're looking at the wondrous, the fantabulous Foodomatic machine. Foodomatic machine? The Foodomatic machine? I can't believe it! Uh, what's the Foodomatic machine? It's only the most amazing cooking invention ever. The Foodomatic can cook any dish in the galaxy right here. We don't even need a recipe. We simply add ingredients and the Foodomatic will do the rest. But what kind of meal should we make? Ah, I know. We'll make Rob surprise. I'll need some strawberries, a pinch of pineapple, a squeeze of squash, oh, and some spaghetti. Can't forget that. Mm, all this talk of food is making me even hungrier. Well, I can fix that. So now what? I don't know. Maybe we push another button, or say please, or uh. uh, 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 uh. What's wrong with that thing? I don't know. Introducing Rob's Surprise, also known as Squash Getty with Pineapple Fruity Meatballs. Squash Getty with Pineapple Fruity Meatballs? Ew. Hmm. Wow, I'm stuffed. I ate so much my tummy trunk is full. Mm. It was mm mm good. Emma, you haven't even touched your food yet. Was something wrong with your dish? Well, it, uh, it's too yucky. I can't eat it. It looks yucky and sounds yucky, so it must taste yucky. How do you know when you haven't even tried it? Because the ingredients in Rob's surprise don't go together. It can't possibly taste good. But Emma, it did taste good. Oh, I don't believe that for one robosecond. <sighs> If we want to win, we'll need to make a simple, normal dish. One everyone will love. But we're running out of time. The cook-off is tomorrow. Wait! I know! Guys, help me put some apples and bananas in the machine. I'll tell you yeah. when to stop. Um... Okay. Oh! How about a little eggplant, Emma? Eggplant and apples, Rob? Ew! Eggplant is delicious! Trust me, Rob, it's yucky! Now let me handle this! I'm the chef! Hmm. You're supposed to be helping me! Is this too many bananas, Emma? Oh! <laughs> Not pickles, Rob! Ick! <gasps> oh, what? Not meatballs, mangoes! No, not mangoes, meatballs! Ah! Isn't normal. 
normal. Everything's gonna be okay, as long as we find a way to shut down the food mat. But how? If we leave here, we'll be toast! Ah! Yeah! See? Don't worry, I have an idea! The coast is clear! Let's go! Okay? I'm so hungry. I can barely move. Aww. You should have some Rob surprise. Uh, why not? I'm hungry enough to eat anything right now. Mm -mm -mm. Wow! This is actually really yummy. Why was I so picky? All I needed to do was try it. It's delicious. Really? Oh, I just wish we had more of it so we could enter it in the cook-off. Huh? Ha! Now that's a Rob surprise! This is going to be a great galactic cook-off. And it's one big yummy mission accomplished! <laughs> mission control? Hi, Rob. You're back. So, what did you learn on your mission? <laughs> I cooked up some Rob's surprise with the food omatic. Only Emma wouldn't even try it. She tried to make her own meal, but we got carried away, and because of us, the machine went haywire. We finally shut it down. By then, Emma was so hungry, she agreed to try my dish. And she liked it. Sometimes it pays to keep an open mind and try new things. What a scrumptiously successful mission. Get ready for countdown. Five, four, 